What's going on guys? This is Ryan with the RK Outpost and ever since the release of Zack Snyder's Justice League on HBO Max, so many different people have joined the call and asked for Warner Brothers to restore the Snyderverse. That doesn't mean stop everything else that's in production. It simply means continue this story along with all the other stories that they're telling across the DC multiverse. But as we all know, there are some people at Warner Brothers that do not want that to happen. will do anything in their power to avoid it because it resembles a massive mistake that they made a dark mark on their record that they were wrong about Zack Snyder and about his DCEU. But we got something yesterday that for a split second had everyone so incredibly excited because they thought that it was an announcement that we would be restoring the Snyderverse, that we would be getting Justice League 2 and 3. And it happened just a few hours after the Army of the Dead trailer dropped and Zack Snyder was trending, Army of the Dead was trending, because obviously anytime Zack Snyder does anything, it's all over social media. We got this from HBO Max. Zack Snyder's Justice League Trilogy Trailer. Uh, that is the thumbnail right here. You can see a lot of people are excited. Zack Snyder's Justice League Trilogy Trailer? Are you saying, are you announcing that we're actually getting the, the Justice League Trilogy, Justice League 2 and 3? Are we restoring the Snyderverse? Then people saw what the trailer actually was. Uh, it is a trailer that is basically hyping up and telling the story from Man of Steel through Batman v Superman, and it's an advertisement for Zack Snyder's Justice League. And a lot of people kind of took this as a slap in the face. And I want to show you exactly where people felt that and why they felt that. Now, we could, we could go through the whole thing. I do kind of recommend you go over there and watch it and leave a comment. Because when you look at the comments, it's very clear what the people want. The time is now, restore the Snyderverse. Missing a few movies, restore the Snyderverse. Just restore the Snyderverse. This is why people are commenting like that. Because they kind of feel like they got insulted by Warner Brothers here. Um, again, we're going through, it's a story about Superman. It's a story about Wonder Woman and Batman coming together. Because it's an advertisement for Justice League. Let me show you where people really got upset. No. We will give the people of Earth an ideal to strive towards. The bell's been rung. Right the here. The god is dead. And they've heard it. I failed in life. I won't fail in death. We have to stand together. Help me find the others like you. That's why people got upset right here because you see it says uh, hey, let's turn the music off so we can just read it uh you got lex luther there the path <laughs> the path was long right and then they say but justice is coming which has everybody incredibly excited what are you gonna say next the completion of Zack Snyder's trilogy. So the talking points that Anne Sarnoff used when she came out and threw water on the Snyderverse, that Man of Steel, BVS, and Justice League was, oh, that was Zack Snyder's trilogy. All of us know that that's not the case. All of us know that it, that was not a trilogy ever supposed to be a trilogy. It was supposed to be a five film arc. Everyone understands that. Even if you want to go off Anne Sarnoff's lies, with that comes the completion of his trilogy. We're happy we've done this, but we're very excited about the plans we all have for the multidimensional DC characters that are being developed right now. When Anne Sarnoff, before anyone knew the numbers, before anything happened, she said, now nah, this is done. We're not doing any more of this. Well, it looks like this trailer on HBO Max is kind of saying the exact same thing, and the comments tell it all. I thought they meant a Justice League trilogy, hashtag restore the Snyderverse. I don't care how many times they say they won't restore it, they won't stop us, not us united, restore the Snyderverse. Everything, every single comment in here has a hashtag restore the Snyderverse. This is what the fans want, this is what people want. And trying to piggyback off Zack Snyder trending, trying to do all this stuff with Army of the Dead to promote this movie. At least they're still promoting the movie, I suppose. But we all know that this is not a trilogy. So what does this mean? 
Does this have any impact? Is this the final say on whether or not they will restore the Snyderverse? If you've listened to a lot of these people out there that say they have inside information, they're saying that we should know soon, whether it's right around the investor call or a little bit after that. One way or the other, they're going to know whether there's any chance of restoring the Snyderverse. But one thing is sure, the fans are still hyped up for the Snyderverse. That, that is clearly what they want. Uh, again, you can scroll down as long as you want. Um, let's see, here we go. What I need right now. This trailer's music. That was one that didn't have Restore the Snyderverse on it. Um, I don't know what this says because it's in Espanol. Uh, here we go. When you think this is a Justice League trilogy and realize this is Man of Steel, BVS, and Wonder Woman. Well, it's actually in Justice League, not Wonder Woman. But I, I, I get what he's saying there. I get what he's saying there. This is insane. It's very clear and it's very obvious exactly what the fans want. Warner Brothers, just give it to them. It doesn't mean erase everything else. It doesn't mean stop everything else you're doing. We know The Rock wants to restore the Snyderverse. We know a lot of people want to restore the Snyderverse. Seems pretty simple. Do it on HBO Max and give everybody what they want. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Smash a like button. Subscribe to the channel. Ring the bell for notifications. Share this video out there. And I'll talk to you later. Thanks for watching, everyone. And a huge shout out to my patrons. I appreciate you guys so much. Want to follow me on Twitter or Instagram? Check out the description below. You'll find links to my P.O. Box and my Patreon as well. And I'll talk to you guys later.